guys. Welcome back to another one of Miss Blue ASMR's YouTube videos. Now, before I get started on the video, um, I've got a quick question. If anyone could uh, bring some insight. Um, I've been searching online and I haven't really been able to find any answers. Does anyone know if interpreting on YouTube a character from a series or a video game? Um, is that plagiarism? Will that get me in trouble with copyright laws? Uh, I can understand like maybe the playing of a game on screen um, would be plagiarism, but is interpreting the character in your own way, is that plagiarism? I would really be interested in listening to um, your ideas on that. Uh, yeah, so um, before I get started on the, uh, you know, the main part of the video, the scenario, um, I'm just going to do my channel naming. So today's channel that I will be naming little drum roll. Is Arioso ASMR. So if you are interested in going and taking a look at that channel, the link is down in the description of this video. And I will see you in one second for Laura's adventure. I don't know why I let the National Geographic channel talk me into this. It is highly unorthodox to have a journalist with me on my tomb raiding trips. But fame has its appeal. Just shh. You have to keep your voice down. We have to keep our voices down if we don't want to wake the dead. So please stay behind me and be careful where you step. These ancient Egyptian tombs, there can be some, there can be some very dangerous traps. for is the lost ancient statuette of Bastet, who is the goddess of fertility and matrimony. The statuette is, has been lost for centuries, millennia even. And Benbridge scholars scholars have never managed to get their hands on it, so that's what I'm looking for today. Shh. There's a mummy. Don't move. Got it. You're all clear. needing those anymore. So, if I'm reading these hieroglyphs correctly, the statuette should be somewhere at the base of this wall. The mother of all mothers. Chambered in the lost city. Yes, yes. They're very close. They're very close. Somewhere 
Again, Lara Croft proves to be better than Ben Bridge scholars. <laughs> Lost forever, hey? Well, this just shows them that patience is a virtue, and you must not give up on your dreams. This statuette is made out of pure silver, decorated with lapis lazuli and pure gold. Don't worry, I got it. I got you back. Bastet, as you can see, is the goddess represented by the head of a cat. Cats being, female cat, being very maternal. This is very fitting for this uh, goddess to be represented by a cat. Now that I have the such red, I'm going to put it in my backpack. So now all we have to do is find our way out without dying. We might have to do some shimmying or angel diving, so I hope you're equipped. You know, journalism down in tombs isn't the best. Um, career because at the end of the day you could end up dead so there's not much job security anyway I need to concentrate on getting you out of here without getting you killed otherwise the National Geographic Channel and Bembridge they're gonna they're gonna sue me for um unlawful endangerment of journalists. So, let's go. Come on. Hi again. I hope you enjoyed the video. I know that this one was a fragment of the uh, normal time uh, I would make my videos to be. But as I said in the beginning of the video, um, I'm not really sure about the technicalities of, um, you know, interpreting a character that's already, um, that already exists in literature or video games. <laughs> um, so I'm not sure about that, so I wanted to make it a little bit shorter just to see how uh, it comes across. Um, see if I get any complaints or problems on YouTube's end with the video. So, um, yeah, I made it short just because I needed to... It's a test run, let's call it a test run. <laughs> and uh, these, obviously, I hope they are not going to be a problem um, again on YouTube's end because I know that firearms um, are 
completely out of the question, but these are, you know, they're plastic and they're toys, there isn't even any, like, little, um, ball-y things that you can shoot out of it, it's really just pieces of, they're just pieces of plastic, so I hope that it doesn't um, pose a problem. Um, I just wanted to say also that, um, I have not found yet a way uh, for me to film my videos where I can actually get a, a full image of myself. Head to toe. This is about the, um, the, the most of myself that I can show because of the height of my stand for my um, backgrounds and also the height of my um, tripod, it all just had that, this is the most that I can show and I think that it's a real big shame because I've got the full apparel of Lara Croft, I've got the boots, I've got the shorts, I've got the gun holster, um, you know, I've just got the whole um, outfit, the, the gloves, the glasses, um, and it's just such a shame that I can't show off the full outfit. Um, so I don't know, I guess I've, I've still got to work on that part uh, of my channel Evolution, which I have not been able to work on recently due to personal problems in which I will not go into detail. So anyway, to finish this video, which is probably going to be um, full of me talking about everything else but the video, the video part of the video is teeny tiny, <laughs> but yeah, anyway, so um, down in the description of this video you will find the link to the channel that I named at the beginning of the video, you will also find my Facebook account um, which is reserved for this channel only, and you will also find my uh, Instagram account for this channel. So, I thank you for watching, I thank you for those of you who actually follow my channel, watch regularly my videos when I manage to make them regular, regularly, so um, thank you. I hope I achieved relaxing you, uh, although with this video I highly doubt it. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much. I love all your comments and your support, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.